Samsung didn't just tell us about its unpacked event to happen in New York City on August 23rd, but the company was clear. This event is to announce the future Galaxy Note. And after a very explosive time last year, obviously a lot of people have set their eyes on this phone, so it's time to consolidate these rumors. I'm Jaime Rivera with Pocket Now, and let's go through what we expect to get from the Samsung Galaxy Note 8. When it comes to design, we really don't expect many changes when compared to the Galaxy S8 Plus. Probably a little more of a square design, like we saw with the Galaxy Note 7 compared to the Galaxy S7 Edge last year. Uh, we also had some CAD leaks and renders on video that showed us glass on glass, aluminum, in addition to the ports being at the same placement. USB-C in addition to the S Pen silo, the headphone jack, and a speaker at the bottom. Yes, we do expect that oddly placed fingerprint scanner to be beside the camera or cameras. And uh, for those of you worried about that, we also expect the iris scanner to make a comeback as well. When it comes to the display, we are expecting the same Infinity display to make a comeback. Slight bump to 6.3 inches diagonal. We do expect the same 18.5 by 9 aspect ratio curves on the borders. The change might be a probable bump into 4K capable resolution. Apparently Samsung wants to do something with VR and it has to do with bringing a slightly better resolution to the display, even though the device will ship with 1080p out of the box with the whole purpose of saving battery life because you are getting a slightly smaller 3300 milliamp hour battery in order to fit the S Pen silo. So yeah, let's see if that one happens. And speaking of S Pen, we are expecting some slight improvements, just like we saw with the S Pen options that we got back at MWC for its tablet lineup supporting Tilt. Now, remember, this Tilt feature depends on certain applications. We are expecting a boost in software. Android 7.1.2, finally Samsung making the jump to this new version of Android, which should also allow us to get better battery efficiency as well. So yeah, S Pen better battery, these are also options on the table. And when it comes to specifications, we are expecting the company to bring the same Snapdragon 835 processor that we saw with its S8 lineup. What we do see a change is in the probability of six gigabytes of RAM now not being only a Korean option. We expect this to be part of the Galaxy Note, in addition to options for storage, 64 and 128 gigabytes, a five megapixel selfie camera, but we do expect dual cameras finally coming to Samsung. The biggest question that nobody's been able to answer is what these dual cameras will do. Some are assuming that these will be the same telephoto options that we get with the iPhone or the OnePlus 5. We are hoping that this is not not the case as we've seen this is really a feature that nobody uses. We would love to see either the wide angle option that we see from LG or the monochrome option that we see from Huawei. Hopefully this comes to the table as well. Last but not least, probably the most controversial rumor is the price tag of this phone. Apparently it'll be costing nearly $1,000 or probably more depending on whatever option you get, whether you go for 64 or 128 gigabytes of storage. That is a lot of money, particularly for a phone that had a really rough time last year. And oddly, there came a point back in the S6 and Note 5 stage where the S6 Edge Plus was actually more expensive than the Note 5 so we don't really understand why this phone will be more expensive. Still, it is a probability. And uh, then the other question that we've been asking ourselves is, what will this phone be named? Because if you remember, there was already a Galaxy Note 8 years ago in the form of a tablet. It leads me to the question of this video. Number one, do you like all the rumors, what we're expecting with the Galaxy Note 8? And number two, what do you think the name will be? Do you think it will be Galaxy Note 8 and the company will just start over here? Or do you think that we should expect a new name? Name. In my case, I love everything that I hear in the rumors. I don't like the price tag, and uh, I think it'll just be called Galaxy Note. I think that they'll just reboot the name. But anyways, leave us a comment down below. We would love to know your opinion. Folks, remember, we will be covering this event live, so make sure you don't miss out. Follow us on social media and hit that subscribe button as well for more videos like this one. You can also follow me on Twitter, Jaime underscore Rivera, or on Instagram at Jaime Rivera. Please give this video a thumbs up if you like what you saw. I am Jaime Rivera. Thanks so much for watching. We will see you on the next one.